Before to the important elections in August, the Citizens Coalition for Change CCC has made an unprecedented legal attempt to rein in the police. The opposition party's filing of a high court application last week to prevent the police from meddling in its campaign operations is a hint that it is now prepared to confront state institutions. Since the party's founding last year, the CCC claims that 67 of its meetings have been prohibited by the police, who also frequently disrupt its demonstrations and detain party executives. Party leaders charged that the police selectively and unfairly enforced the law by permitting gatherings of the ZNPF government while prohibiting most CCC activities. Police restrictions on CCC public meetings. According to CCC legislator Wellington Chikombo, who filed the application with other party members, are against both domestic law and international treaties that Zimbabwe has ratified. The tenacious opposition group is asking the High Court to get a ruling prohibiting the police from prohibiting any additional CCC events. Nelson Chamisa, the leader of the CCC, claims that ZANU-PF benefits from the unequal political playing field, but he maintains that his party will not abstain from the elections in 2018. The time has come for CCC to display what we are made of. He argues, political observers caution that if the restrictions on CCC campaigning are not resolved, it might lead to a contentious vote and complicate the post-election process. It is unclear how much law enforcement would be restrained by the courts before the crucial elections. One thing is certain, though, CCC has the cops in a legal corner at this point.